Hey guys, good morning. So summers are almost here and it's making me want to wear these bright neon pinks, yellow, lime greens and orange. Talking about orange, let's start with my favorite orange lipsticks. I'm going to start with something which is recently launched by L'Oreal and this is in shade Mademoiselle Mango. This is the most neonish orange I own but it is the most flattering orange I own you guys. I'm loving this orange these days. I was forever scared with the orange lipsticks because I used to be scared that it will wash me out and it does you guys but this shade is very flattering on all skin tones be your fair, medium, deeper, duskier. It will suit deeper dusky skin tone so very well this is your shade you guys but let me warn you there that this formula is little bit tacky it remains tacky for one hour when i do this my lips get stuck and that's how tacky it is but after one or two hours stickiness little bit goes away and uh, this is so long lasting it lasts forever like literally forever it was so hard to remove you guys okay let me swatch it on my hand for you so that you can see how it looks on my hand and uh, this is how it looks you guys it's a bright neon orange and smells so good smells like cupcakes the shade you guys is like calling out my name mind me let's go on a vacation but and guys if you're not sure about whether this shade will suit you or not i'll leave my foundation shades in the description box for you to cross check. Now my next shade is very rusty orange or maybe pumpkin orange. There's a shade in Lime Crime, very popular shade, very similar to this shade. Um, Lime Crime is not in India. So I was looking for this shade and I found it in Sugar. This shade is Gotta Terracotta and this shade is a very rusty orange. Let me swatch it on my hand, you guys. And you know how I feel about the formula of these liquid lipsticks. I feel that they are drying. So use lip balm. This is how it looks. It's a very pretty, flattering and kind of nude orange maybe. Very unique shade. I love it for its uniqueness. Next, I have a very cute lip tint for you guys. This is by Etude House, Dear Darling, in shade OR202, I guess. Yeah, OR202. And this is a very bright orange shade. I'm kind of wearing this shade all the time in the house and this is how it looks it gives that look when you drink mirinda or fanta that kind of look you know what i mean and i feel that acute house lip tints are so so good especially for the price they're gel based long lasting and very smooth on lips they're not drying at all and you can use it on your cheeks also now let's move on to something very cheap. This is by Lacme. This is the Lacme Forever Matte Liquid Lip Color. I own so many uh, lipsticks from this range. And this shade is Orange Tango. And I feel this is very wearable orange shade, you guys. And this is so cheap. This is for 299 rupees. And the product in this tube is so amazing. Worth the money. Only thing I feel that... Only thing I feel that the doe foot applicator could be better. It's so bad. I really don't feel like applying my lipstick using this. But the product is so good. It's not sheer. It's opaque. It will give you orange lips, like opaque orange lips, you guys. And this shade is very wearable. If you're thinking of trying an orange shade and you're not sure about it, whether it will suit you or not, start with this and then go with other shades, I feel. Okay, now let's move on to my next shade. This is Flame of the Game. I know I mentioned it in my red lipstick, but I think that this is also orange. So I'm going to include it in my orange lipstick. I love it that much, you guys. This is so pretty shade. So pretty, so flattering. It will suit every Indian skin tone. No matter what skin tone you are, it will suit you. And you guys know I love these liquid lipstick formulas. Uh, but this shade is like a little bit sheer. You have to apply it a few times. But it gets better once it's dried out um so don't worry about that but yeah it's so cheap you guys so i think you can give it a shot and i feel that uh, these liquid cat suit lipsticks are so unique all the shades are so different you will find it in the higher range higher price range so yeah gotta give it a try so this is how flame of the game looks like by wet and wild now my next lip tint is by benefit and this is cha cha tint i feel this lip tint is for men 
If I had a boyfriend, I think I would make him wear it. So guys, this is how Chachanin looks like on my hand. It's a mango tinted lip and cheek stain. It gives a very natural look to your lips. It's like it's not there, but it's there and it makes them look good and better. My lips but better kind of thing. Lip tint again. This is by Peripera and this is their Ink Velvet Lip Tint. And this is in shade Intuit Rose, you guys. And you guys know these lip tints are very creamier. I've mentioned it in my favorite lip tints video. If you haven't seen that, go and watch that. My lip tint videos do so well on YouTube. So thank you so much for that, you guys. You're amazing. And uh, let me swatch it on my hand. And this is how Intuit Rose looks like. I know it's not looking very orangish. It's kind of nude orange, you guys. And it leaves it's a very um, nudey and uh, reddish orange tint behind. Uh, it doesn't stay like this. It changes colors, you know. So let's move on to next. My next lipstick is by Masaba by Nika in shade Kant D. If you guys don't wear liquid lipstick, then this is for you. This is in the bullet form. And the formula is neither matte, neither creamy. It's in between. It's very comfortable and it's very wearable orange. And this is how Kant D looks like on my hand. And the packaging is also cute. You guys know that by now. So let's move on to my next lipstick. And this is by Lakme in shade Orange Sugar. And this was launched in collaboration with Karina Kapoor Khan. And uh, let me swatch it for you guys. It's a very glittery orange shade. Um, this is how it looks. You guys can see it's glittery, but it's not uh, chunky. It's very wearable. And the finish of this lipstick is creamy. It's not matte finish and it's not transfer proof. Um, I feel that this is expensive for the product. Like 1000 rupees is not worth 1000 rupees. Even if you give a clutch with this, it's not worth 1000 rupees. Don't even buy it, you guys. I actually just wanted to mention it because it's a pretty shade and it's the only shade I mentioned which has glitter in it. It's kind of shiny. So I just wanted to mention it. Um, now let's move on to my next uh, and last shade this is by wet and wild again and this is in shade coral corruption i feel that this shade is kind of orange peachy coral maybe a nude orange or peach you guys decide but i generally wear it with my yellow eyeshadows and it looks so so damn good with yellow eyeshadows amazing especially orange lipsticks look so good with yellow eyeshadow and uh, your peach lipsticks and I do have a video on my top 10 favorite peach lipsticks, so you can watch that. And with this, I'm going to take you to leave you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment. It helps your sister. It will kind of trigger the algorithm, YouTube algorithm. So yes, please help me. <laughs> and I'll see you soon. Bye.